Thomas, I need you to go get the last tray for Christmas. And for the presents and people. Yes, sir. I hope there won't be too much snow. There shouldn't be. Okay, sir. You should pick it up from that food. Okay, sir. Oh, so, Thomas, I know it isn't snowing now, but you might want to buy your snow plow just in case. Um. Beep. <laughs> oh yes, you can get yeah, in that for now. Oh yes. Where is that comet so you can pick up the last tray before Christmas? Oh, hi Thomas, where were you? Oh, I was, yes, uh, I was, I was in the shed. Were you asleep? No, Sir Thomas, I was actually telling me about this assignment. Oh, oh, oh that makes much more sense. <laughs> Sorry. Well, I gotta go take some, I gotta go take some trucks over, you know, you know that little sign in front of the head? Yeah, I do. I was about to take some trucks over there. And here is your next assignment. Your next assignment is to go over to the yachts and pick up a box from the harbor. But, you don't need to do that until tomorrow. So... When you're with that, you can just go to sleep. Okay. Bye, Percy. Bye, Thomas. Divers, break! How are we gonna clear all this? I know, I'll be like one of my heroes from one of my favorite movies. The Polar Express. You plow it through a thing of ears. I think I really plow through them, but you make them walk away. Maybe I can push these out of the way because it just makes snow. Okay, Thomas. I first, as my friend would say, full steam ahead. You yeah, have a brain presence and the uh, people here at Thomas. Did you write a snow or trouble? I read to a little snow, but I was able to push through it. Like my hero, the Polar Express. Would you want to watch it? Mm, maybe later. I'm a little worried that Thomas would you that Percy. <laughs> We turn in. <laughs> I'm worried you would turn just like somebody from the Blue Express. Ooh, maybe me and him should watch it. Ooh, that'd be a good idea. How about we set that up? Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. How about later today, you and him watch it? Oh, yeah. 